Hello guys and welcome to the new series. In the next few weeks I will be playing through and giving my own personal opinion on the games released for free on GOG.com, not a sponsor, link in description, for their stay at home campaign in the face of the current pandemic. I will be installing and playing through these and maybe by watching this you'll get an idea on whether you want to play them for yourself or not, and maybe learn something or not, who knows. Without further ado, let's begin chronologically with Akalabeth, World of Doom, released in 1979. Richard Garriott, known commonly to the fanbase as Lord British, was a teenager studying in Houston, Texas. He started development of Akalabeth as a school project hoping to bring the experience of a Dungeons and Dragons campaign to the computer platform. It was eventually released for the Apple II home computer. This computer's color graphics actually inspired the company to redesign its logo to the style I personally am more familiar with. Look at this beauty! Uppercase keyboard, audio cassette interface, and hmm, up to 48 kilobytes of RAM, baby. Here we are, this is the first screen of the game, and uh, now we type our lucky number. So let me just get right here then. The level of play. Does that mean the difficulty? Uh, okay, well, I... maybe? Okay. So we got 15 hit points, 15 strength, 24 dexterity, 11 stamina, 19 wisdom, and 21 gold. Shalt thou play with these qualities? Oh my. Uh, I guess? Got a lot of dexterity. Can I make a rogue? Oh, whoops. Well, I pressed enter and it shuffled stuff around. So we can actually... Huh. And so maybe we have to press Y for yes. And shalt thou be a fighter or a mage? Uh-huh. Hmm. Let's be a maging. Welcome to the adventure shop. Stats, weapons, which item shalt thou buy? Let's see what happens if we press F, I guess. Wait, but we don't have that much gold, do we? We have 22 gold. So, um... That magic amulet costs 15. Okay, so we can buy one food, so let's press F. Okay, there we go. We've got 10 food. Hmm. Seeing as we're a mage, we don't really need any of this. I guess the magic amulet? Let's press M. Okay, we got a magic amulet. Shall we spend the rest on food? I mean, I guess. I hope I'm not screwing myself up here. Uh. Oh well, yeah, rest on food. There we go. And Q is quit. So now we quit, right? Bye. <laughs> okay. Welcome to Akalabeth, World of Doom. Huh. What happens at... Ooh. Okay, we went north. What's this X thing? Not sure. Hell... Oh, whoops. I just typed... H-E, thinking I could maybe... <laughs> hmm. Okay, now, so the, the thing doesn't know what's happening. What happens if I press Q? Nope. W? Nope. E? Nope. Okay, we... Did we just go through a wall? Uh-oh. Uh, this looks like, uh, looks like something we might need to fight. Let's attack by pressing U, I guess. With our hands, I guess. You are being attacked by a skeleton. Missed. Uh-huh. Hey, we hit him. He's got two hit points. And let's, uh... Okay, we missed. Did you run away? 
Oh, there he is. Come here. You... Thou hast killed the skeleton. Thou shalt receive two pieces of eight. Alright. And uh, we're back here. Okay, so I press U, which is the attack command. Now, which weapon do I use? Can I now press S for spells? Oh, uh, what the heck happened? Um, which weapon hands? He stole my food! You scum! I... You... Yeah, uh huh? Come back here, you... Oh, excuse me? Oh, uh... I missed. And he ran away. Come here. You're not going anywhere, buddy. You have starved. Uh, whoops. <laughs> we mourn the passing of the peasant and his computer to invoke a miracle of resurrection. Okay. Hmm. I think I might need the instruction manual for this one. Shall there be a fighter or a mage? Mage it is. Now, we want the magic amulet. There we go. And we're spending the rest on food. So, here we are. So ideally, what the game guide told me to do was find the castle. It is by finding the castle that we get our quest. But, we have zero gold and not a lot of food. So let's go explore anyway, who cares. I could try and hit a dungeon, try and look for the... Try and get some gold before doing any of this, but... Uh, let's just try and find the castle over here so we can... Uh, hmm. So we can figure out where we're at, so we can get some freaking direction in this freaking game. See, we're next to mountains, that's a town. Oh. So let's try and do this differently. Yeah, that, that, that's a decent amount of stats. Yes. And I'm going to be a fighter now because, you know, I, I am bad at amulets. Even though the guide said that uh, that was the way to, um, to win. Okay, so let, let's try and get the rapier. Is that R? Oh, there we go, we got a rapier. And let's spend the rest on food so that we don't have to worry as much. Okay, so we actually have a pretty decent amount of food. So, we're going to quit. Yes, we spent all our gold. And so now, let's try and find that castle. <laughs> hmm. There's a dungeon, there's a town. So if we don't find the castle, we'll just stop near a town that has a dungeon nearby, if we can find one in time. And we'll just try and grind out some gold. Okay, so this town has a dungeon right there. Hmm. Yep, I have no idea where the castle is, and, uh, where- oh, whoops. Aha! There's the castle! So how do we enter the castle? We press E. Welcome, peasant, into the halls of the mighty Lord British. Herein thou may choose to dare battle with the evil creatures of the depths for great reward. What is thy name, peasant? Peace. I, uh, abide. Dost thou wish for grand adventure? Yes. Good! Thou shalt try to become a knight. Thy first task is to go into the dungeons and return only after killing a an mimic. Go now upon this quest, and may Lady Luck be fair unto you. Also I, British, have increased each of thy attributes by one. Press space to continue. Okay. Alright, so we need to go kill an mimic. Hmm. 
Let's stop at the uh, shop over here, get some food. Not that we have a lot of gold, just one. And uh, now we have to go... Oh, there we go. There's two towns around the castle. And an dungeon. So, we go into the dungeon. There we go. A thief! Immediately. Okay. So we're going to attack. Which weapon? Ugh. If I press R, is that the rapier? Yes! Thief's hit points. Three. Wait a second. If I hit pause, I can look around, right? I'm still spending food to do this. Yo. Uh -oh. Okay, well, um... Let's try and kill the skeleton. Oopsie. I'm missing a lot. I've killed the skeleton. Let's try and kill the giant rat. It's trying to run away. And it ran away. Oh, there's a chest. Yeah, huh? And an axe. Let's try and attack him with the rapier. We've killed him and got four pieces of eight. That's nice. Ah, there you are, you. You. Oh, yeah, we killed him. Three pieces of eight. That's nice. That's nice, too. So let's, uh... Okay, there's another chest. Is that a trapdoor? Five pieces of eight and a bow and arrows. Okay. If I press E, will I drop down on this thing? Go down to level two. Is that what happened? Also, Arga Trap falling to level three. Yeah, boy, guys. I don't think we're getting out of this <laughs> this dungeon. Oh no, we found the uh, ladder up. Okay, that's that's not bad. Oh, uh, it uh, viper. Okay, not a mimic. Uh, rapier, I guess. And uh, again, and uh, again. It's trying to kill us. Hmm. Okay, we killed him. We got him. Let's try and make our way back to that uh, ladder. This one, yes. So, ooh, 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 chest and giant rat. Okay. Um. Hmm. Where are you? Where do you think you're going? Boom! Got him. Now, if only we could find a mimic. That would. Uh, Make everything nice. Let's just keep exploring the dungeon. Maybe we find the ladder up. Okay, there we go. There we go. A nice chest. A nice chest. And, um, hmm. Trapdoor. Wait a second. It's weird how it turns you around. So, f like, I went through that door. What? See? All I did was press forward and back, and it... It orients you in a different way. So we go through the door. This is what we see. We go through the... Okay. So, oh, wait. That's a ladder up. Okay. Huh? Okay. Ladder up. Ooh, a chest. One piece of eight and a magic amulet. Uh-huh. There's the uh, next... Uh, our next victim. Uh, rapier? Okay. And again... I missed, but yeah, okay. Hmm. You see all I did? Oh, I see. When you press, when you go through a door, and then you press the uh, down arrow key, it then faces you in the direction through which you came through the door. Okay, that's oh, that's a lot of doors. Okay, so that okay, there's a trap door over here. Okay, I found a chest and a shield, and there's a ladder up. There we go. Uh, command, leave dungeon. Yes. We got 53 gold. Not bad. Not bad at all. And there's the castle still. Okay, okay. Just making sure. Hmm. Well, I suppose we need food. I guess. Hmm. Aha! Yeah Wait, we're being attacked by a skeleton as well. Okay, well, let's... Ah, the thief stole the amulet, you scum. Well, first we're gonna kill... Come back here. Come back here. Where are you going? He went through the wall. Well, there you go. Now you're dead. And this guy's still tailing me, stealing stuff from my pockets. You... Wait. I probably should have read that. 
Which weapon? Rapier, not owned. Did he steal my rapier? Kill them. That thief did a number on our inventory. We only have an axe and one bow and arrows, so... Yeah. Nice, nice. Thanks a lot there, thief. What is this, viper? Grr. You throw or... Okay. Or axe swing. Axe swing. Axe and swing. Man, the axe does nothing. Well, which weapon? Shield. Wait, what? Axe... Uh... Axe shield. Wait. Rapier. What? Oh, I attacked with my hands. Whoopsie. Attack with the axe, not owned. Oh, I see. Well, let's kill him with our hands, I guess. Taking down a viper with our bare hands. Bet you didn't think that's where all this would end up. Uh, okay. We could, uh, Wait, what's that? Is it a... No, it's an orc. Well, we still have HP, so maybe we can try killing an orc with our bare hands. We got nothing. Freaking thief. Or maybe we broke the rapier. Well, it's... Uh, yeah, I got nothing. All I got is my hands. Well, we're killing him. Hmm. But he's also hitting us. A thief stole a food. What? Dude, where are all these thieves coming from? You... Uh... Uh... uh. Also, one thing that I find really unfair is that when the thief steals your frickin' food, you don't get it back when you kill him. How's that fair? I take this. We're about to kill the thief with our bare hands. We're savages. Ugh, there you go. Oh, a rat. Okay, sure. Now we kill a rat with our bare hands. Okay, this is it's pretty gruesome. Pretty, uh, children, look away. Oh, we can go down to level 5. Boom. I don't think I've ever made it this far in the dungeon. And, uh, it's got... okay. I think this is a trapdoor. Well, let's just keep going down, why not? Level 6? Uh... Okay. You are being attacked by a mimic. Yes! Oh, I missed. Kill him. Kill him. Oh, wow, that's a lot of HP. Okay. We missed again. We missed again. We keep missing. But we found the Mimic. We found the freaking Mimic. In level 6, behind a freaking wall. Uh. How hard is it to attack something that is literally a chest? Okay. Oh, boy. Our, uh, our HP is kind of going down over here. Sure would be nice if we could land some hits. Oh boy. You boy. We keep missing. We... Okay, boom! We slew the Mimic. So now we kill the uh, Viper. And we missed. Because <laughs> of course we did. Come on. Don't let me die to the Viper now, man. I need, I need to get out of this dungeon. Oh boy. Pretty sure the Viper did some heavy damage there. Okay, it's running away, it seems. Okay. Thank you. Yes, leave the dungeon, please. Okay. We killed the Mimic. Let's go and find the castle again. There we are. Let's tell the King what we have accomplished. Yes! Are you ready, guys? Please. Go now and complete thy quest. I killed the Mimic! Dude! Are you kidding me right now? I killed the freaking Mimic! Dude. You gotta be joking me. Okay, so we got five magic amulets and a bunch of... We don't need any of this. Come on, man! Go now and complete thy quest. You told me to kill a Mimic. I killed a Mimic. Oh god. So, what else did you want? 
I got tons of food, tons of HP, tons of gold. Ugh. Well, that, that was kind of interesting. I mean... Oh, I passed somehow. Okay. Go now complete thy quest. You know, the least you could do is tell me what else I need to do. Uh... Well, I... Killed the mimic. Hmm. Okay, guys. Well, I... I think that's pretty much going to do it for this game. I could probably still figure it out and try and play through it, but I mean... With so many... I don't know, with so many modern games that have been done... I... I mean, it's interesting to see something like this. Uh, it's, it's definitely interesting to see something of a bygone age, basically. Um, I would actually rate it decently high. I mean, if, if you can get past the whole... <laughs> if you can get past what you're seeing, this isn't bad. This is actually pretty good. You got stats, you get gold for killing mobs. It's not... I mean, it's not super difficult. There, there were... It was, you know, here and there, it was kind of touch and go, but I gotta say, when I was trying to leave a dungeon with 7 HP getting freaking attacked by mobs and just trying to get out after having killed a Mimic, I mean, it was pretty exhilarating. I, I gotta admit, the game has a certain charm, and I actually kind of like it. Like, if I, if I knew what I was doing a little bit better, I think I would actually enjoy this quite a lot. As it is, I've got, got enough footage to give my opinion, so, you know, there's a lot more to come yet, and, uh, yeah, what you see is what you get. I'd say it's, it's pretty good. It's pretty entertaining. That's what a game should be. It should keep you entertained, and uh, it's gone dark, and I've barely noticed. I can't see anything around me, so, anyway, with that, I'm going to call it, and uh, I'll catch you guys next time.